All right. Speaking of a team mm-hmm. that uh, that has like no pitching question marks, you know, because we're out here, we're talking about our squad. Who do we pitch in the freaking wild card? Mm-hmm. I guess these guys have that same question, but right. it's it, it's for a completely different reason. It's the Milwaukee Brewers, and I want to ask you right now, with yeah. the staff that they have, and with the fact that Corbin Burns and Josh Hader just combined it for a no-no, yep, 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 deserved, 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 do these Milwaukee Brewers, the Brew Crew, mm-hmm. have the best pitching in the league? I looked at it. Mm-hmm. I thought, you know, I thought they did, but it's not better than the LA Dodgers. It is not better. Looking at the Brew Crew, mm-hmm. their ERA right now, the ERA Plus. I was looking at ERA Plus. I sometimes like to dabble on the Plus, the sure, OPS Plus, because it just kind of it, it takes out the ballparks, makes it all even. So ERA Plus is a 126. That's second in baseball. Pretty good. Number one, who's yeah. first, is the Dodgers at 136. That's actually quite higher. Mm-hmm. So Dodgers have been better. And actually, you know who the, uh, they're tied with? They're tied with the Giants in the ERA Plus. Yes, dude. The you know? Giants are elite. I think that this question, the the one that we're asking right now, do they have the best pitching in the league? No. I do think that the Dodgers, yeah. like, they are right up there at the top. But it's their whole encompassing staff. Their starters, their bullpen, their closers. Everything about the Dodgers pitching is incredible. But I do think that if we were to rephrase this question okay. and go, do the Milwaukee Brewers have the best starting rotation in the entire league i think that answer changes to yes because the dodgers yes they are incredible they got bueller urias yeah. Kershaw. like Kershaw that's all incredible healthy, yeah. but when you look at those brew crew a 2.25 era from corbin burns the baseball savant is crazy oh, a amazing. 2.48 from brandon wardruff amazing innings incredible strikeout rate and elite baseball savant as well and then a 2.69 era <laughs> From freaking Freddie Peralta. He's doing exactly what Ray's doing, minus the yes. strikeout numbers. Yes. Actually, 127 innings, yeah. 172 strikeouts. Not bad for he's, strikeouts. He's got a better strikeout rate than Ray, I believe. No way. Like, it's actually, well, like, it's, it's very me. close. It's very close, me. Yeah. <laughs> But, like, it, it, it's like these guys are actually messed up. That it's like they have... Like literally Cy Young yes, contenders, three Cy Young contenders. The board. I do it's think amazing. that when you look at all the teams pitching, the Dodgers, the Giants, they win out when it comes to the bullpen. Yeah, yeah. But there is not a goddamn way in hell that I want to be entering a no, wild card. No, that I want to no. be entering a playoff game stacked up against Corbin Burns, Brandon Woodruff. Or Freddie goddamn no, no, Peralta. No, that's that's like you're gonna have a what a four man rotation. That's what they usually will do. Three or four, you can pretty much kiss those games goodbye. You gotta have great at bats, or else you're uh, not gonna make it to the next round. Yeah, dude. So I, I will I will agree with you. Dodgers best pitching in the league, Ro- all but, around. But best starting rotation. I don't know, man. These, I, these I'll, I'll agree. Like, I love, I love Bueller. I love Urias. I love Kershaw. But yeah, they're they're just too good this year. It's too they're good. Too good it's this year. too elite. Too good. Too good. Too good.